Okay, so here's a daddy long legs, and I want you to see what this these spiders have done for me. They're kind of cool. Um, right at the end here, there's two little web puffs. Okay, so the spider is kind of helpful. Let's see if I can get that in there. Okay, and spiders like this were useful to me and are useful to me and uh, because that is my artwork the spider reminded me of when i was a child i did artwork like that where there's the two right here okay two eyes and a little further back okay is the snout okay and the spider's like in the location of part of the artwork that I did as a child. So, so the spider is like a decorator also. It's kind of fun. If you look at my other video, um, last winter I was pointing to a spider web. I made a couple loops at the top of the ceiling. Okay and made like loops like that and that was just the spider was reminding me of how i decorated for holidays with my um holiday lights and the spider decorated <laughs> my room a little bit so they're kind of funny that way i prefer them outside so i tried to get these outside but they kept coming back because of different storms and stuff, so um, I keep trying to help them back outside though, but I wanted to give an example of how useful they are. So one of the neat things about spiders is they know when um, severe storms might be approaching or being formed in the ocean and stuff and they help me as a person, a human being, prepare for what could possibly be um, devastating weather, hurricanes or tropical storms, things like that. Uh, so this spider, is, this kind of spider normally is not mid of the wall when they're in the house. They're usually at the top where the roof is okay and they might crawl on the wall or whatever but this one has stayed here um, has stayed still the past couple of days and there was another one also um, where I'm at right now and the reason they do that is because uh, when I was younger uh, a relative of mine taught me about the weather and they had like a barometer when to know when a hurricane might be approaching as a warning to just be able to track the weather now what I did not like is that social media and other weather people looked through my head okay and took advantage of that knowledge for themselves that was me and the relative's knowledge. And we did not get credit for that. See what I'm saying? Didn't get paid. Okay, I don't like that. Aside from that, just so you know, uh, I showed a video where a spider kind of swirled, a recent video, kind of curved. Okay, that, that was another warning like a tropical storm or a hurricane was approaching or nearby forming. Okay, same thing with this. So the spider is like, this kind of spider for me is showing me that the pressure is dropped and that means a tropical storm or hurricane might be approaching. Okay, I also feel something in my body and maybe I'll talk about that in another video where I can tell when something like that is approaching just as a warning signal to prepare for what might be devastating doesn't 
doesn't necessarily mean that will happen, but um, if the creatures of the earth are preparing, then that kind of gives me a clue that I just needed to prepare regarding certain things. Um, so the, the spider is about, oh, maybe a third of the way down the wall, actually about mid of the wall from the top of the roof to the floor. And so the, the spider has been helping me discern uh, how the storm is doing, okay? So I just, you know, I wanted to inform people about, on my channel about my own channel, not through my head, where people take advantage of me, but on my own channel, on YouTube and other social media I have, that I do myself, um, apart from my head, okay? Uh, that these creatures are very helpful, but they get a bad rep. They're considered pests, things like that, but I see them differently. And, I mean, I don't like that the spiders come into my housing, but I'm not going to stand there and murder them. There's a reason they do that, and um, I try to help them outside, but in this case, the spiders all came the ones that I released recently, they came back in because they, they were kind of warning me about a storm and reminding me of things. So if people like struggle with uh, Alzheimer's or something, I, or just some memory loss because of what's been done to my head through people hypnotizing me since my birth kind of thing to control me, you know? to puppet me. Um, I've needed like reminders from the earth to help me remember who I am, what I am, and what I'm about, you know, kind of thing, um, and what happened to me over time. Okay, and they're very helpful that way. But I know these creatures like that for a reason. Okay, so after I um, talked about more about how the spider helps me with weather and stuff and other creatures, uh, the spider left the spot, okay? But the spider was showing me uh, my old artwork as a child and using that as a map, a locator for the eye of the storm. And so the spider gave me an accurate uh, picture of where the eye of the storm was. And that is how detailed and specific those creatures are and how helpful they are. Way more accurate than um, people reporting the weather on the news kind of thing. Because that's the earth speaking. You know, not secondhand knowledge that is like... Um, clearly a source of information is God, okay, and the earth knows very well where a storm is located and how close they are to land, storms and stuff, so kind of cool, really cool, cool. Um, not that the news is not helpful, that's, you know, that can be helpful, but uh, when we get to learn about how the creatures interact with humanity, uh, I can learn a lot, and uh, I, that's that's what I've learned over time. So.